Hi, I'm Bonnie Wright. We're here on the cover shoot for Hope News magazine. So with Bonnie, we wanted to do something very glamorous with a edge. So something very luxurious, the clothing is obviously embellished and sort of a couture look. So we had lots of looks, I think about eight in total. Um, they're very sort of high fashion couture um, outfits, some of them really sculpted and others a bit more sort of ethereal and flowing. I mean, with the clothes, I think Victoria's obviously brought a real fashion edge to it. Soft versus hard, that kind of, you know, stuff with contrast. She has beautiful skin. I haven't really done much. Well, I didn't have to. Oh, yeah. <laughs> it started quite natural the makeup, but it seemed to go more and more powerful. And we had like red lips, dark lips, then the lighter. I, I use um, pencil a lot. I mean, to like red lip pencils, so like take really nice shapes, and then paint inside with the lipstick. I've always just loved fashion that's a bit more of a performance rather than. I mean, obviously like everyday things, but. I think what's enjoyable about shoots is you can get away with things that you've dreamed of wearing but not necessarily able to. Been moving the hair around today a bit, had kind of a vintage feel to it, a little bit French Vogue, maybe try and pop some wire in it as well, make it do something interesting. I like to wear just really simple pieces of my own that have been with me a long time, like a piece of my jewellery from my parents right here that I always wear like every day. like to wear things that are just really nice and you feel good in them. I think that's what's always important for clothes. I don't usually wear that much makeup in the day, but I think just essentials like really moisturising your skin and different things. I always use La Prairie foundation because it's really fine. Quite like a lot of Bobbi Brown and sort of Aveda things, yeah. I guess for... You know, for the Middle East, it's kind of there's all, obviously a sort of a very much a Western sort of influence upon their fashion. But I think what's interesting is they always put a twist on it that seems a bit more sort of exotic, and I think that's what's always fun. Sort of